What's going on everybody and welcome back. I'm doing a little bit of an update and a review on our Renogy 12 volt solar panels. We have 2400 watts of these. We're planning on getting more. This is not a lot by any means, but it works for us. We do occasionally have to run a generator just because we're slightly underpowered on these. And that's more so to do with our battery setup than anything else. But we don't really run a whole lot of power. So these 2400 watts, they work for us. And this, this video right here is just kind of give you an update on, we've been running them for about three years now. Not all of these panels are three years old, but they're all pretty close. And uh, they, they've all held up great to the weather, whether it be hot, cold, sleet, snow, rain, shine, doesn't matter. They are very durable. I, I enjoy that much out of them. And they, man, they're just a good quality panel. And they work extremely well, in my opinion. They, they handle the heat pretty well. They do work decent in low light. I think these are actually classified and set for more of a low light panel, to be honest with you. But I got addicted to the Renogy company because their price point and quality is like right there. And it's hard to beat. I mean, there are other companies out there that you can do a little bit better with. And you can certainly get a better dollar per watt ratio when you go into a bigger panel. But for me, the trade-off wasn't there in the bigger panels, given the fact that bigger panels are just so difficult to handle by yourself. And really, out here, when you're living, you know, off the grid, doing your thing, it, sometimes you don't always have the available manpower in order to, you know, lug those those big panels around. And with these smaller ones, these are like 22 inches by like 44 inches in size and weigh around 14 to 15 pounds a piece. And it's just easy for any one person in my household to, to be able to go ahead and grab one and change it out or, you know, if that needed to happen. It hasn't happened yet, but... In the assembly process, it was really simple for, you know, everyone that was out helping. They could just grab a part and stand there, assembly line it, and put it together, and it worked out. And that's that's the biggest thing for me, is the ease of use and anyone being able to handle them. Because as we get up closer here, I mean, they're just, this isn't fixed on 100%, so I can kind of wiggle it. I need to get a bracket back there. But they're super light, super easy to use, and again, for the price point to size, it's it's just there for me. And another thing is to just go and show that you don't have to spend ridiculously large amounts of money on these setups in order to make them work. And yeah, I can do a lot better of a job than what I have done here, but it's been working for us again. And... This is all, you know, even though some of this lumber is brand new, it's just stuff that was either given to us or we found it or whatever. People just didn't need it and may as well put it to use and just use what we've got. I mean, it makes sense. Save some money wherever you can. Now, again, this is not put together as perfect as it should be. But again, it works. I like it. It's done really, really well for us and it's easy to set up our angle could be adjusted in a little bit better here but throughout the the year three years that we've been running these out here i have been using renogy for over eight years now maybe a little bit more um but they i just really like the company and they work really good the uh i'll give you the specs here on these things i'll get up close so you guys can look at them these are 12 volt panels we have them wired in series parallel and groups of, what do I have here? Group, four groups of six. And we have them wired in that way. And it, again, throughout the years, we figured out this is just what works best for us for mounting, power, output, and all the in-betweens. And it's just easiest for us to do it this particular way. Got the pigs and the chickens back here doing their thing. But, yeah, these panels, I'm telling you, rain, sleet, snow, shine, hail, it doesn't matter. They've held up. They can take a beating. I honestly try to make sure they don't, but 
we do get we do get the hail out here and it does beat on them and they've held up i haven't had one break you know knock on wood haven't had any damage knock on wood and they they perform we do want to add some more here in the near future but we're just kind of waiting on that because right now we we can drag down a lot more power with our inverter setup and everything that we have inside because we're maxed out right now on one inverter and have another one ready to stack but we're working it all into into position but we run a normal household like anyone else would we've got computers and stove what else tv full refrigerator We've got our deep freezer outside right now because it's cold enough we don't have to worry about running it but in the summer we run it to have all the typical things that a typical household would have and we're running 2400 watts and we have about 8.75 kilowatts worth of batteries in the house right now which is not really a lot by any means we do run the generator from time to time to top off because like i said we could use a little bit more battery power a little bit more storage space we use it up but we'll run the generator a couple hours here or there, wherever. It just kind of depends. But overall, if anyone's looking for a cheap a cheap panel that's not cheap, like a low-cost, good, high-quality panel, these Renogy ones, you're, you're not going to beat them. Um, one thing I will say, though, is they, they have these. You can get them occasionally a little bit cheaper by ordering a two-pack. And I did notice this. And this... This whole set is actually the two-pack one, so you can notice they have a blue corner on them. Now let me show you this, because most of these were ordered in two-packs. When you order the two-pack, I don't know why, but they come with these blue corners on them. They're exactly the same panel for the most part, but they got those blue corners, and then you can see the panel design right here is just a touch different than the one without a blue corner where it doesn't have that little zigzaggy thing on it. And I have a few of those that were ordered individually. Why that is, I don't know. The panels are exactly the same as far as the uh, the output and all the different information on them. Just a tiny different design for some, some reason, whatever. I don't know. But again, these Renogy panels, I in my opinion, you can't beat them for the quality and the way that they hold up and function the weight i mean it's it's all there for me it makes sense for me and i've got bad shoulders as it is so it is what it is but yeah these panels have held up great anyone that's interested in trying to get into solar this is a good way to get in get started and kind of check it out and see if it's something for you or something that you like and if it is it is if it's not it's not and you don't waste a ton of money doing it but if you're gonna get into it i'd recommend trying these panels for sure they've worked for us and uh, i really like them so thanks for watching and if anyone has any questions feel free to shoot me a comment down in the comments below and we'll see what we can get figured out for you i'll also leave a link for these if anyone's interested you can go ahead and purchase down there through amazon is where i get them but have a great day and thanks for watching